Hi, my beautiful Pisces. What's up, you guys? All right, I'm going to be doing another quick channel message for you guys. Five cards. Let's see. It could be past, present, future energy for some of you guys. Let's see what the message is. What is the message that I need to get to my beautiful Pisces? All right, Pisces, let's see. What is this message? And Pisces, don't forget to hit that like button from you guys. What is the message I need to get to Pisces? Okay. Four Cups energy here in reverse, Pisces. We have Strength here, the Knight of Swords, the Eight of Cups, the Sun here, and the Ten of Cups in reverse. Okay, so I am getting this energy. For some of you guys, this could be like a family dynamic that you have with someone or some type of relationship, okay? It does feel like a love connection here for some reason. Um, it could be very well like a situation where this is involving children for some of you guys, or maybe even your child personally. <clears throat> That's not going to be everyone's story. Take what resonates, leave the rest. But I do feel like whoever this person is, I feel like this person is obviously finding it very hard to walk away from you. Walk away from the emotions and feelings here. It feels very positive. It feels like Leo energy strong in this energy, uh, Leo, but someone's like holding back in regards to something that they want to say. And what's crazy is they feel this urgency. Someone here feel an urgency to like communicate to you, talk to you. This is somebody that walked away from you nonchalant, nonchalant, nonchalant in a nonchalant manner. They walked away from you as if maybe they did not care or they're like, yeah, they ignored you at one point. Okay, this person ignored you. I feel like this person, whoever this person is, you may have a family dynamic with this person. You may have children with this person <clears throat> or it's a situation where um, this may even be your child. Someone walked away as if they did not care in a very nonchalant manner, but that's not truly how they truly feel it's more of like what they wanted to show you or what they wanted you to see and i feel like this person has a strong urgency to say something to you they feel the strong urge to communicate take some type of action here with the knight of swords like yeah say something to you but they're holding back Tell me more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, King of Cups here. It could be a Pisces, Scorpio, or a Cancer. Okay. So this person here, I feel like in the past, this person was ignoring you, um, giving you the cold shoulder, blowing you off, acting very nonchalant. They may even be doing this now in the current moment. Um, they're closing their emotions and feelings off to you in a situation. Or they're trying to, or they've been emotionally detached from you in the past or trying to keep their emotions out of a situation here with you. I feel like in the present moment, like moving forward, they feel bad. I feel like they do feel the injustice in this situation. So literally, this person's over our energy, like they feel the, the injustice that they're actually giving to you. They feel that the situation isn't right. It isn't balanced. They feel like they've done you wrong in some way by doing this, by closing their emotions off, by ignoring you. And now it's almost as if, I want to say the table has turned, but now they're feeling the effects of what they have done. They It's like they try to remain emotionally detached 
but this it's like now they're feeling some type of way about this. It's like they know that this was wrong by doing this to you in some way. Tell me more. It's to the point where it's affecting their own emotions. Four of Pentacles in reverse. Now this person wants to open up. Okay, maybe in the present moment, moving towards the future, it looks like this person does want to um, kind of open up. Yeah, during a time where they were like pushing you away, maybe. Yeah, I feel like this person wants to kind of like, I want to say like let down their guards a little remain open to a situation or try to open themselves up to a situation here with you. Like, cause four, four is here. So in order for there to be some type of stability in a situation, cause I feel like, yeah. Yeah. Cause that's five. Yeah. This person is really wanting to like recover something here emotionally with you. They want to recover something emotionally. Yeah, they want to recover from something. It's like they're also kind of like I'm getting this energy where they're they're moving away from something that they may have felt they were in their feelings. And I feel like now they're trying to be a little more emotionally mature about a situation they may have took this situation wrong they took this situation though it's so weird it's like they were just emotionally immature about something they were being very emotionally immature not wanting to face something here or kind of like face their own emotions and feelings and so now i feel like they're definitely recovering from that they want to recover from a situation here emotionally with you but first they have to recover for themselves like they have to really confront their own emotions and feelings. And I feel like once they do that, they will open up to you here. They will open up. Or will cause them to be like a little more open to a situation here with you. That's what I'm saying. Um, it's not more of to you. It's just like they're becoming more open or more like vulnerable to a situation here with you. <clears throat> Where there was a form of resistance or chaos or they were fighting something. They were fighting like they were fighting not being open to a situation they're they're becoming a little more open to the situation is what it looks like okay tell me more because now we're going to be looking towards the future what's happening here okay death here in reverse this could be a scorpio heavy scorpio energy okay could be any other sign could be someone here who has definitely been uh you'll know this person because they definitely have been someone who's been like emotionally closed off and detached from you so yeah the death here is in reverse and then the overall energy ace of cups upright that's what i'm saying <clears throat> i do <f> <clears throat> I do feel like this person finds this transition. Okay, this this is okay. This is not an overnight transition. So if you're inquiring about this person, because this is what I'm getting from you guys' energy when you're looking at this, I'm picking things from your energy that you're wanting to know that you need clarity on. If you feel like this is an overnight transition, it's not going to be something overnight, is what I'm hearing. I feel like it's been taking it's been taking this person up into this moment to even get to this place right now. And I do feel like there's still some part of them that is needing to change or there's some part of them that is like maybe even like their ego with the four pentacles something here that needs to like die off. It, it, there needs to be a transformation. So I do feel like in the in the future coming moving forward this person is still going through some type of transition or major transition here it, it feels like something in regards to adjusting to some type of change 
This person is having a hard time adjusting to the change that's happening. Because the Ace of Cups is something new. The Ace of Cups is something new. So, yeah. I, wow. Okay, Spirit. I just heard that this is a process. This is a process. Okay, this... <clears throat> I just heard that this is a process. Spirit just said this is a this is going to this is taking this is a process. Mostly meaning transformations are processes, right? There it's a certain cycle. So um, because I feel like this is something there's something happening that this person did not really want. Uh, they felt they didn't want this. At one point they did not want this. They because the four cups they were they kept like ignoring something or being nonchalant because they didn't really want it, uh, you know. So it's taking them some time for, or it's taking time for something here to kind of like drive forward or move forward here in order for them to see this as maybe like a positive change or a positive thing or something that's like, that could be really good or could be really happy or exciting for them. Um, they just don't, they never, they didn't see it like that. They don't see it like that. Mm. Now give me one more card. Mm -hmm. The Knight of Pentacles energy. Yeah. The Knight is the slowest night. Okay, so the Knight of Pentacles is the slowest night. Okay, slowest night here, or quarant, we should say, in the deck. So it's like I'm hearing they have to process this. And that's what you see. You see this woman sitting by the tree with this death card here. They're still trying to process this. This could also be a process of elimination. I feel like this person is going through some type of process of elimination. Um, they're, you know, maybe weighing some type of pros and cons. So, I'm, yeah, I'm just really hearing there. This, this is something that's going to take like some time here pisces okay this is going to take time and it's going to be a very slow moving transition or process okay and it's one of those things where i feel like you have to maybe learn you're going to learn here in this knight of pentacles i'm seeing you learning to be patient with someone's um their own emotions and feelings Maybe in regards to them opening up to something here with you or opening up to a situation. Like I said, this could be your child. Um, this could be them, like, you know, feeling, can I be emotionally vulnerable with Pisces again? Can I open myself up? You know, I feel like this is like, this is good I, over our energy. We have a tower. <clears throat> so, yeah, this person has definitely been avoiding you. We have the death in reverse. We have the tower. This person has been on break with you. They've been avoiding you. They've been avoiding conversating, sending you a message, communicating with you. They're avoiding you. Yes, this person has been avoiding you because I feel like they don't want to really confront their own emotions and feelings or they, they don't want to confront something here that may require them to be in touch with their emotions or feelings here. It's like, I feel like this person may have been keeping themselves numb or like numb to the situation. And now I do feel like this person is wanting an opportunity here with you. Or they're going to be wanting to revisit an opportunity or warm back up to an op opportunity here with you. An opportunity that they kept avoiding or ignoring here. This could be, you could be dealing with another Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. This could be someone um, that's going to be like, the tower is here. So I feel like this person is going to show up maybe abruptly after like not speaking to you in a while or not speaking to you in four weeks, four months, four days. It's like they're going to show up abruptly here in your life after like this break, this pause, or like they haven't said anything and boom, they just pop up. And it's like, they're looking at an opportunity that they passed by with you. And it's not just an, an opportunity. It's just been multiple times that they could have, they could have like opened up emotionally to you. So yeah. And it's crazy because I still see this person as someone who's like still, still trying to 
kind of mature within their emotions and feelings, you know, still trying to figure out how to handle it, how to express it appropriately, how to show it appropriately. You know how, like they always say there's a time and a place. Well, yeah, this person is still someone here who's just not, it's weird. I feel like they're also not comfortable with their own being like, they're not comfortable with their own emotions and feelings. They're not comfortable with showing it, expressing it. God damn, this person is just, yes, they're, they're having to do a lot of, this person in the past, I feel like they have had to do a lot of emotional maturing. And it may still be, it's still like, it's still a process, Pisces. It is still a process. So don't, I don't want to be mean and say, well, you know, don't even give your hopes up, but just know that this is still a process that this person is still undergoing. They're still learning different cues or different things here on how to handle their emotions and feelings. Um, so yeah. <clears throat> I don't know why I get this energy, energy to that. Um, they may also be like, they're taking some type of notes. I feel like they're also like learning this through a connection here with you or understanding something. I feel like this person does want to understand you more or understand the situation a little more, but it's just, it's really taking them time. Wow. I feel like this person has to relearn something all over again. The understanding of something. Okay. Okay. They're having also, they're going through some type of process here, Pisces, and transformation. So um, I really don't want to like give your hopes up with this person because I feel like this person has, I'm hearing they have a long way to go. They have a long way to go. It's like they have a long way to go when it, when it comes to like really letting someone into their heart or letting someone close to them or accepting something and just, you know, being okay with change, unnecessary change here in their life. And I feel like it's so sad because I can feel, I can feel the, the stunt. Like, I feel like this person in, in, re, in regards to their growth, they've been stunted a lot because they want to allow themselves to grow. They want to allow themselves to, yeah, it's like mature emotionally in a situation. They want to allow themselves to grow. Like habits that's no longer good for them. Things that has like, they're just, they're not. Gosh, I don't know why I get this energy where like they're not trying to spiritually evolve, you know, from a lot of things, situations, emotions, feelings. It's like more of like they, they, they rather wallow in this than learn from it. And I've been saying this, I've said this in another reading where, you know, do you want to grow or do you want to just like, do you want to go through things and grow through it? Or do you just want to go through things and keep going through things and going through things? Or do you want to go through things and go through things? And I feel like this is somebody who goes through things, but they don't grow it. They don't grow through it. Like, you know, and um, shout out to one of my best friends, Shalite, because she always says that she communicates that like, I don't want to be the person that goes through things, but don't grow through it. And that's what's going on with this person. Okay, that's what's going on with this person in your energy. Give me one card here. So this is slow and steady, kind of wins the race type of energy with this person. What's the message that I need to get to Pisces in regards to this person or this situation here? Yeah, very soon. Clearly decide what it is that you want so that it comes to you now. And then we have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So, yeah. I feel like, again, this person is very interested in something here with you. But I feel like at the end of the day, this very soon card here is clearly to decide what it is that you want so that it comes to you now. I feel like this is one of those things where you can't make this decision for this person, okay? And this person has to get to a place where they're, they're ready or they're ready. And I feel like, honestly, I'm going to keep it real with you. I feel like maybe in the moment, 
They feel this from moment to moment, but I don't feel like they're ready, but they're preparing themselves. They're, they're in a, like in a place of preparation, but they're not quite ready yet. I mean, I see them in the moment. I see them like kind of being in the moment and it's like, they can see it for themselves. They can see you guys being together or they can see you guys being close. Or for a moment, it's like, they feel that they can do this. They feel that they could be happy. They feel that they can open their heart up. They feel like they can be okay with the situation, whatever that is. But then it's like from moment to moment, it's not like this is something that like they're set settled in. So this person is not settled. And so I do feel like they are still in a position where they're still in decision mode and they're still trying to figure it out, Pisces, okay? They're still trying to clearly decide what it is that they want so that they can make this happen in the present moment here with you. But I do feel like, again, this is going to be a, like a slow moving process, right, Pisces?